Well? We're sorry, my lady. We were just having fun. This is not a game. It's a battle plan. Allies and enemies can be made with every move. Yet they say it is men who are powerful. <laughs> the Queen was rather disappointed by your display, Mira. I'm just glad it's over. King's Landing can be exhausting sometimes. There's always someone to please or some perceived slight to smooth over. I fear it will only get worse when I am queen. Once they know your true heart, the lords and ladies will have no choice but to love you. Do you agree? Sure. Once you are queen, the lords and ladies will do their best to please you. You learn very quickly. Your words to Cersei were brave, but I know you must fear what the Boltons might do to your family. I do appreciate your willingness to appease her, as difficult as it may have been. Thank you, my lady. There's been something on my mind. Something important. Very important. I... I did have a favor to ask of you in return. Whatever you wish to say, you can say it in front of Sarah. There are no secrets between us. I want hers killed. It's about my family. I trust her. Go on. Oh. Ask. Forgive me, my lady. I wouldn't otherwise ask this of you, but... My mother insisted. It's about my family. Ramsay Snow. What would you have me do? Oh. My mother fears our family will suffer if Ramsay is left to do as he likes. She thought, if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown. I know it's a lot to ask of you, and I wouldn't otherwise, but she insisted. That is no small request, especially now. I know, my lady, and I wouldn't ask this of you otherwise. Damn. But my mother has left me no choice. Said that three she times. Insisted. Joffrey knows only too well your family fought for the Starks, and now you would have me ask him to intervene. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. King Joffrey won't like it. Just think how he turned on Lady Sansa. My mother feels it is urgent, my lady. She's unfamiliar with King's Landing and its politics. I hope you can understand that. No. Very well. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise anything. Thank you, my lady. I will send a raven to my family at once. Should've, should've kicked Sarah out. Just these awkward like transitions. You see him freeze and then load. <laughs> Damn it, horse. Seven elves. This guy. Did you know my ancestors wore the skins of their enemies as a coat? <gasps> Not my best work, unfortunately. I suppose I have full enough practice. But he didn't make it easy. What with all that bloody noise? <laughs> Like a I like how like every time I peek he, he pulls out his uh crossbow. As my father likes to say, it goes up. a naked man holds few secrets. But the flayed man the flayed man holds none. 
pity he didn't know your father is the warden of the north. Oh shit. He does now. How much further is he is dead? It to these foresters? Uh, a day, my lord. Two at most. What was that? My lord? Shh. Listen. Freaking Ruth. No. Ramsey. It's not yeah. There. Hear that? It's a horse. I know I heard something. Running will not solve anything. Never mind. We've wasted enough time already. Back, man. I don't agree with this. Who are you? You, who, who, who? Oh, I really want to know. Oh, well, damn. Don't know who that was, but he's he's dead, so oh, we're at the wall. Wanna meet John Snow. Hey, it's this asshole. Oh, Ethan. No, that's no that's okay, never mind. As I was saying, you are young. And there are those within these walls who are uncertain of your leadership. I thought it was the the, the wall. But the Night's Watch. 300 generations of Forester Lords stand behind you. Lord Gerhard the Tall, who founded our house, and your grandfather, Lord Thorin the Bold, who seized back the river valley from the White Hills. What did they call my father? Lord Gregor the Good. Thor the Bold the Good. He was fair and wise. And what would they call me? That is for you to define as the new lord. Oh shit. These were your father's people to lead and protect, and now they're yours. But your father did not bear this responsibility alone. He and every forester lord before him chose one man whom they trusted above all others, the Lord Sentinel. Forester traditions demand that a new Lord Sentinel must be chosen. Okay, okay. I see you, big dog. Oh, what happened? I've done nothing wrong. I was only trying to survive. Lord Ethan. Mister. You spoke of judgment, Sir Royland. What judgment is that? This craven is a deserter and a thief. This house is doomed! We all fucking know it! Quiet, thief. Eric was supposed to be guarding our weapons, but instead we caught him stealing them. Oh, shit. Two shields and three spears. You stole from us. I feared for my life. Yes, my lord. I fled. We should all flee. It's not stealing if you're taking what's yours by right. He speaks He's truth. Right. I've a family to feed. They're not two coins to rub together since Lord Gregor left us to rot here. Where's our pay? Our share of bread and wine grows smaller every day. <laughs> Leave the poor man alone. Oh, my God. It's a tough decision Ethan, for me. I know these words are hard, but they're honest. This house is falling. We'll never survive the coming winter. Calm yourself. The time for calm passed with the late Lord Forrester. Now there's only chaos. You'll address him as Lord. I like the Sir Rowling guy. Lord Ethan, you must decide the punishment. Lord Gregor always took a thief's fingers. Three of them. 
Now may not be the time for harsh punishment. The men are on edge as it the is. Men need to know they cannot do whatever the fuck they please. This is true. But their lord will not permit it. You can send him to the war. If I were in this situation, which I am, hmm. if you punish me, you'll be punishing an innocent man. You'll be an injustice, my lord. Please, my lord, my family depends on me. Shit. Ah. <sighs> Them to the wall. I sentence you to the wall, where you will join the Night's Watch. Oh, please, my lord! My family, without me, they'll die! I would have still at mercy, but screw that. That was certainly unpleasant, but a lord must meet out punishment when it's due. Not just yourself, of course. It's a lord's duty, so I did it. You heard what the thief said. I expect this sort of thing will happen again. But a sentinel can help you in the face of disloyalty. You need someone you can trust by your side. Sir Roylan. Someone you can rely on, no matter the circumstance. Possessing wisdom. Who do you think I should choose? There are two capable men for the role. They both want the job, but neither thinks very highly of the other. How do I decide between them? Talk to them. Solicit the opinion of people close to you. <laughs> I want Sora Roiland. The Bracer of the Sentinel. The Badge of Office. Tonight is your first small council meeting. It would be wise to bestow this Bracer upon your chosen Sentinel then. To show that you are decisive and in control of this house. Your sentinel will wear this for all to see. I'll make the right choice as sentinel. Will you? speak with me when you're ready to convene the small council, my lord. Because he's just a maester, right? Like, do I want a maester or do I want a, a warrior? Come on now. Who are you? Wait, who's this guy? No, is that Duncan? If Duncan is the other option, I'm totally not choosing Duncan. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. I'm not choosing that guy. <laughs> 